Welcome back to the channel, today's headline. Other senior members of the royal family have been gathering at Balmoral, the Queen's Scottish estate following the allegations facing Prince Andrew, where Queen Elizabeth is said to be holding crisis talks. Prince Andrew currently came under scrutiny as a previously cropped image was released of the prince alongside Virginia Roberts, an image which he claimed previously was fake. A thumb of the person who took the snap appears to the right hand side of the shot, though the identity of the photographer remains unconfirmed. The release of the image came as Miss Roberts, now married and known as Virginia Garuff, has instigated a lawsuit with the intent to sue Prince Andrew due to claims she was forced to have sex with the royal under duress while still a minor. The prince strenuously denies all claims and has not yet officially responded to the new lawsuit. Head of Scotland Yard, Dame Cressida Dick, warned that the British police would assist any inquiries into the Duke's sex abuse allegations. The commissioner told LBC, when asked about the decision to sue Andrew, nobody is above the law. As a result of what's going on, I've asked my team to have another look at the material. The Prince of Wales was spotted with his wife Camilla, the Duchess of Cornwall, at his side heading to Royal Deeside. It is rumoured that the royal is question is it unlikely to attend the Platinum Jubilee celebrations, which will mark Her Majesty's 70th year as Head of State next summer, if he is still involved in the case launched by Miss Roberts. The case has been described as a grenade waiting to go off by a lawyer, and could have a long-lasting effect on the monarchy and their integrity and values. It is believed that many of the senior royals have expressed concerns that the case will overshadow the Jubilee celebrations with Prince Charles said to have privately expressed unease over the handling of the Duke of York's latest legal crisis. In the past, Charles has issued warnings to Andrew of reputational damage done by his links to pedophile Jeffrey Epstein. Just 24 hours after the news of the lawsuit broke earlier this week, the Duke of York was seen arriving to face his mother, Queen Elizabeth II. It is believed that while Prince Andrew and his ex-wife Sarah, Duchess of York, arrived at the monarch's private Scottish estate, his lawyers held crisis talks over the allegations he is facing. Some senior royal sources told The Telegraph that should the rape accusations linger, that the disgraced prince may have his military title stripped and will not be present at his mother's platinum jubilee celebrations. Despite the initial civil proceedings accusing the 61-year-old royal of rape in the first degree, sexual battery and sexual abuse coming on Monday, there has been no reaction from Andrew's camp. The prince has three weeks to respond to the claims made by Ms. Gariff, and if he fails to do so, she could ask the court to find in her favour without the need for a trial, which would be potentially disastrous for the Duke's reputation. The result of the lawsuit could leave an inedible stain on the reputation of the royal family, according to one royal expert. Thank you for watching and don't forget to like, comment and subscribe.